Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little video here on iOS 8.2 official, which I have on both the oldest iPhone that can run this, the iPhone 4S, and on the iPhone 6, which is the best iPhone to date. So let's just open up some apps here. I just want to confirm here that I am running on 8.2, 12D, 508 uh, on both these. Sweet. You can also see how the same kind of apps open up here. So maybe it also is gonna show to you it's on the same Wi-Fi, the best Wi-Fi I can run. Uh, the iPhone 4S can only run on my Netscape 46 versus this one which can run on the 5G which is like a little bit faster usually. But it's still the same Wi-Fi. <laughs> Let's uh, see. First of all, you can kind of see here also you don't get the Apple Watch app. Uh, you don't get that app here on the iPhone 4S because it's not supported. Uh, but yeah, let's uh, fire up some things here and uh, have fun with that. Let's go. A little bit slow there, but I'm not going to judge that hard. You can see for yourself. Just go in here to something. It looks like it still can have some pretty nice speed here. Let's just fire up the camera. Did I see almost some light there on the iPhone? <laughs> on the newer iPhone calendar. Let's go with messages. Well, there we did some season like the only for us. And let's go with the health app. Interesting. This one doesn't have anything on the dashboard. Default. Take a little bit longer there. Flyover over maps should be better on iOS 8.2. Okay, we did see a little bit of difference there, but why is the app looking different? That was kind of round. Let's fire up the App Store. Okay, here we start to see big differences in terms of speed. Even when you're going in here to an app. Oh! Finally there, we did see a big difference, interesting. But most of the times it seems to be a little bit faster there on uh, the iPhone 6. Well, there we start to see some lag there when uh, uh, we start to get some, a lot of apps open up here. Let's see here, Passbook. Whoa, now we really start to see the forest seems to be struggling here a little bit. And again, the Wi Fi here, kind of some slowness there. Again, took some time there. Let's open up a third party app. Wow, okay. Starting to even opening folder there on the 
on the 4S seems to be having some problems. And now I need to calibrate and do all those things. I don't want to try that out at the moment. Oh yeah. I already tried that up. Let's go multi talking here. Let's jump into an app. So, you can quickly look there at some apps firing up here. I mean, you start really start to see the difference here when uh, you were firing up a lot of apps at the same time when opening up folders and stuff like that. Was struggling here a little bit on uh, the, the 4S. So I have some other apps that I didn't fire up, but uh, I probably might do more videos, uh, check out some more stuff. I didn't use the Safari browser here, but as I said, I might do some more videos checking that out. But uh, yeah, quickly a video checking that out. Have a nice